All right, we are here in Beijing, and can you please introduce yourself? Hello, everyone. This is Peter, the co-founder of Stager Live. Can you tell us uh, a little bit about Stager Live? Stager Live is a live broadcasting service for Japan market, and uh, we are serve we serve the Japan musicians and the gamer, and uh, they can show their talents in our live broadcasting service. And you guys are currently highly rated in the App Store. Is that correct? Uh, now, yeah, we are pretty high rated in App Store and the Google Play both. Excellent. And um, can you tell us like a little bit about the company? How long have you guys been around for? Mm -hmm. This company started one year ago, and um, and start from the three or four. Uh, start. Uh, this company started one year ago and uh, started for from four founder. I was one of the founder, and. Um, one year development, we now we have uh, achieved around uh, eight eight hundred thousand users in Japan market. That's incredible. How did uh, how did you guys the the founders meet? How did, did you know each mm -hmm. other prior? Mm -hmm. The CEO he was uh, um, the CEO has the experience to build a live broadcasting service for Indonesia market, and uh, the service called uh, Clip on You. And uh, after he built that product and. Uh, we meet and we start. We decide to do a live broadcasting service for Japan market, because Japan is um, a market that have lots of uh, great musicians, and gamers, and uh, have very high approval. And um, um, this this Japan market is a pro hmm, a product built for Japan will be very good brand for the global. We want to build a global. <laughs> We want to, well, we want to build a global brand, and we believe that Japan is a good start. Excellent, and uh, the product really speaks for itself. Can we see a little demo and kind of show people what okay. what type of content you have on here? And I won't show your password. <laughs> and this product called Stager Life, and um, and you can see we we this is um, we show our live broadcasters here, and this is music channel, and this is game channel. For the game channel, you can see the Japan users that play their game, and they, they love do, this game in Japan. Yeah, and we can send uh, gifts to them, and uh, I talk to him. Hey, he's saying hello to me, and uh, we have a, a music channel, and uh, the musicians they love to play guitar and they talk, interact with their fan. And now we have uh, signed over 1,000 official live broadcasters. What's an official live broadcaster? Um, official live broadcaster. First, they they are very capable to playing like uh, uh, music and uh, good singers. And um, for live bro good official live broadcaster, we'll, we will help them to uh, to have more opportunity to like offline activity and uh, like um, we will hold many competitions so the good one will uh, win some awards and we have our resources to promote them yeah and these are all users who are connected watching right now yeah, and yeah, viewing. Yeah. Um, that's really really cool mm -hmm. um can you talk a little bit about um uh, kind of like what what it was like to build with AWS. Were you like a member of the Activate mm. program? Okay. The story between Stay Your Life and uh, Amazon are start from Activate's program. And uh, a year ago, we are invested by uh, K two VC. Uh, they are one of our uh, investors, and uh, very luckily, uh, they provide us the information about the Activate uh, program. Uh, we are actually for the startup like us. Um, we are benefit a lot because it is really safe. Lots of our budget, and uh, the ser the service is very stable and uh, really uh, trustworthy. So you got uh, credits to help kind of get started and up and going. Did you get any like technical guidance or advice um, from AWS to help build? Yeah, the the Winston really help us a lot about. Uh, he visits a lot and uh, really uh, fast to serve, solve any of our. Uh, question problems, yeah. That's fantastic. And um, mm -hmm. 
Uh, I imagine with a company that or product that's being adopted this quickly in Japan mm -hmm. that you see rapid user growth. Mm -hmm. Like, were, was there ever a time where you saw kind of a, a quick increase in demand and you mm -hmm. had to deal with that scale? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the one of the really great tech, uh, technology about the AWS is uh, auto scaling. And uh, let me give you one example. Uh, in January, we uh, hold a campaign. Uh, all our uh, musicians, they, uh, they com compete each other to win the chance to be the model of our advertisement. And uh, usually uh, every day around 1,000 broadcaster and they broadcast in our platform. But at that day, it's over 2,000 live broadcasters live that day. And uh, Amazon auto scaling really help us to 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 be able to handle yeah, that yeah, amount of traffic. Really, yeah. Yeah. The AWS auto scaling really help us to handle that traffic. And uh, or that day, usually that we use two uh, EC2 uh, server. At that day, they automatically adjust to the four server. So that's incredible yeah, to think like, that you, you guys had mm -hmm. 2,000 live streaming mm -hmm. video like users on your site uh -huh. and not only did auto scale to handle it but uh -huh. you only needed four instances to manage it all mm -hmm. which is yeah. just tremendous so yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's a lot of testament to the application you guys built to handle that scale yeah, yeah. but uh, happy to know that our instances yeah, yeah. held up for you really appreciate. Um, but that's really cool well thank you for taking the time to show uh -huh. us the demo I'm actually really curious to, to uh -huh. install it and take a look at it yeah, yeah. Thank, and, you very much. Uh, thank you thank you thank you